after my father passed away, uh, a principal of a school, uh, Dennis Maurice in Ontario, took me under his wing and he basically brought me right to the university and I'm sitting there coding next to all these university students and, and here I am, I'm eight and nine years old. He said that I had a gift. And it wasn't the gift necessarily of being able to code or ability, a gift in terms of technology, but he defined it as a gift of finding dots that people didn't see and connecting them together. There's a subtle difference between being a dreamer and being a futurist, right? Uh, the futurist will try to predict tomorrow based on current trends and analytics, uh, which is great. But if you want to see a world that doesn't have any current place in it, that requires a dream. I think one of the things that's lost a lot of times is hope. We see the world changing around us so rapidly we figure that we'll never be able to keep up or we'll never have an influence in it. Only the diamonds actually pop to the states of Zuckerberg. That's not the case. So throughout your life you're going you're gonna to struggle with your own calling. Whether somebody tells you it's not right or you tell yourself it's not right, believe in yourself. Find a way to make that calling your life. I'm Alan Devine. I am TELUS's first chief dreamer.